I'm gonna show you how you wash your hands. First, get some soap. Now scrub and count to 20. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Now open the water. And we're done. Always need to grab your mask and, and grab it from the side and put it, get it from the sinks and put it back here by your nose and by your mouth. Remember it in motion to open your wings, have space and bye. I pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now the Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge of allegiance to the Texas, one state under God, one and indivisible. Happy Thursday morning, Frank Macias Elementary School. Today is Thursday, October 29th, 2020. We are now on our final day of Red Ribbon Week at Frank Macias. Thank you for watching. ENN at FMEU. And if you did not see the Class Dojo post last night, we sent it out late. We're doing a call out this morning. We have to postpone our Soaring Eagle Awards ceremony. We apologize to all our families who are affected. So once again, we will not have our presentation of the Soaring Eagles today. It will take place next week, and we will let all our families know once the new award ceremony is scheduled. Well, something that has not been postponed is our Say Boo to Drugs Day. Today is your opportunity, kids, to dress up like your favorite storybook character. Parents and teachers, please post all those wonderful pictures of our eagles in their costumes today. And in case you did not hear the news, no school tomorrow for our eagles, that is. Teachers, sorry, we have to work. Enjoy your extra day off, kids. As I mentioned earlier, we want everybody to post their pictures from this week. Here is the address on your screen. Just log into bit.ly slash FME dash RR and upload all those pictures. If anybody took pictures from Snow Day, we'd love to have those included on the album as well. And here is a quick sampling of some of the pictures that have been uploaded so far. We've got Pajama Day. Our sports jersey day. And yesterday's wear your pink day. Thank you again to everyone who has shared their pictures. And one final note regarding Red Ribbon Week. We want to remind everyone to share their videos on Flipgrid. Please tell everyone how we can be happy, be brave, and be drug free. There's that link ready for everyone. You record directly on the Flipgrid software. You can do it on the Chromebooks. You can do it on the iPads. And speaking of Flipgrid, wow, FME Eagles, we already have 66 videos that have been posted about the Rube Goldberg machine. 
I want to share a really fun example that we found on YouTube. Check it out. I have to say that invention was pretty cool, yet you should see what our FME Eagles have also been putting together. Remember, 66 videos have been posted. However, look at that final bullet that I put there. You have to show your Rube Goldberg machine and you have to explain the science behind how it works. So again, students, keep up the great work on these videos. They are due tomorrow. But don't forget to explain the science. What forces are in play in your Rube Goldberg machine? And sometimes it takes a couple tries until you have success. Keep up the great work, Eagle Scientists. Moving on to Dreambox. All of our students are required to complete at least six lessons per week. We highlighted the highest weekly usage winners on ENN yesterday. Congratulations to all these classes that earned 100% last week on Dreambox. The highest grade levels, number one, fifth grade at 91%, second grade at 88%, and the highest weekly per percentage excuse me, of students completing those six lessons, three classes hit the 80% or higher mark. Great job. And again, fifth grade, congratulations. You were the highest grade level to complete those six lessons. And I want to thank everyone yesterday for your participation in Winning Wednesday. 60 plus staff members participated. We introduced our book of the month. I am making sure that all copies are distributed today. So if you do not receive your copy of the book, teachers, please let me know. We'll get that out to you. Hey, Ariana. I have a question for all our FME Eagles. Hey, Eagles, how do we fly? Respectful, responsible, safe and kind, eagle heart and eagle mind. We have a new attendance competition going on. So the last competition was free dress. This new competition is Happy meal. So let's check attendance for this week. We did not start off very good on Monday. Yikes. However, Tuesday's attendance did come in at 95%. We're getting just a little bit closer to that goal, everybody, of 98%. Two grade levels did achieve 98%. Congratulations, second grade and fifth grade. You have earned your H for Happy Meal. So this is how it's going to work, everybody. The first grade level that spells out Happy Meal will be entered into the raffle. And how the raffle works is we will draw out five students from that winning grade level randomly. And those are the kiddos that will earn those Happy Meals. So good luck to everybody in this competition. And let's keep improving our attendance.
So today we have one eagle celebrating his birthday. Shout out to DeAndre Leatherberry, fifth grade. Tomorrow we've got two more fifth graders who have a birthday, Andres Munoz and Serenity Rodriguez. Happy birthday to you guys. No Halloween birthdays on Saturday. And if you have a birthday on Sunday, November 1st, we will make sure we include you on Monday's birthday report. Happy birthday, everybody. Before we conclude today's news, I have to remind everybody our Soaring Eagle Awards has been postponed. We will not be able to have our ceremony today. We will announce as soon as possible when it will take place next week. And that's it for ENN, kind of a lengthy podcast with some pretty cool videos. Good luck to all the kids on their Red Ribbon Week Flipgrids and to all our amazing Eagle scientists. Get all those Flipgrids in for your Rube Goldberg machines and don't forget to explain how it works and the forces behind it and what simple machines you're integrating. I can't wait to see them all. You guys all have a great Thursday. A fantastic Friday, wonderful Halloween Saturday, and rest up on Sunday from that sugar high. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.